The holidays can be a stressful and demanding time of year. The stress of creating the perfect party, serving the perfect food, buying the perfect gift, all on a budget. Add to that stress, lack of sleep, lack of energy, it starts to take a toll. For some, the holidays are a reminder of loss. The loss of a spouse or family member can lead to depression, anxiety, and feelings of loneliness. The Lifestream Behavioral Center helps people get through these trying times with hope for the holidays. The reason the holidays are so significant is one, where we're supposed to be joyful and looking forward to it. We forget sometimes about what might trigger a person during the holidays. Hope for the holidays means you're not alone. Hope for the holidays means that we at Livestream care about you. We have about 700 staff in different areas that are all willing to help and to provide referrals to you, help you just figure out what you're having such difficulty with. It could be finances. You know, I'm a young mother and I have three kids and they're seeing this stuff on TV and I can't buy any of it. We have holiday drives for things that will take that burden off of you so that you can enjoy your children and celebrate the holiday. A lot of people will say this is a first Christmas alone. What is going to happen for people that had a loss? And that could be that child has suffered a loss of parents the year before or a relationship breakup with someone in their current environment. If you have lost a husband or a sibling through death, and particularly if any of those things occurred during the months of, say, October through February even, it could trigger, that whole event could trigger itself again because it might have been so traumatic and sad. And so one of the helpful things to do is to, if you know of someone who has suffered that in the family or has a loss that they, you think might come back up, is to recognize it. You and Grandpa were really close and we're getting ready to have Thanksgiving dinner and I just want to make sure that we honor him at the dinner. And so give them ways that they can honor people but recognize that memory still is there and the sadness is there. So we're trying to give people hope for the holidays that you're not alone. And if you're feeling grief or sadness or loss and you feel yourself getting mired in depression, thoughts of anxiety, it's just pick up the phone and reach out. We have a crisis hotline, so at any time anyone can call that 24 hours a day. So when someone's depressed and not sleeping, it's a good time for them to pick the phone up because somebody is there and will answer. If you'd like information on the many services available at the Lifestream Behavioral Center, just click the Hope for the Holidays story link icon on our homepage at yourhometownhealth.com.